and we're here at uh, Linera Connect. And uh, who are you? Uh, actually, I'm uh, uh, from High Sirga. I'm a hermit. Yeah. And uh, you're showing right here the poplar board right here, uh, made by uh, Hopran. Yeah. So you have this board right here. Yeah, exactly. So what's special about this board? Uh, actually, this is oh. the first. Uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, if, you, that is, yeah, yeah. if you can come closer to the mic while, while I film. Oh, okay. It. Yeah, a little bit closer. Like yeah. This. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, this is the first uh, 96 ball for Kiwi edition. Uh, it's a typical uh, uh, set box uh, chipset, and it can support uh, some features just like a 4K video playback, HDR and uh, Dolby Vision HDR, and uh, also the you, you can see right now we can support the Android TV. So here actually is uh, Android TV uh, video uh, is playing. So can you use the remote on it? Yeah, sure. sure. So uh, you can see uh, actually that is the uh, YouTube UI on Android TV, and uh, you, we, we, uh, there's a lot of 4K video, uh, so I can just choose one and it will be play. So this is a full Android TV. Uh, it's a full Android TV actually. And uh, so this is uh, supports uh, 4K 60, 4K 65. HDR. And uh, VP9 and uh, uh, H264, uh, 265. HDR. Yes. HLG. HLG and uh, Dubbish HDR. Nice. And yeah. it has two USB ports, one USB 3. Can we show it a little bit? Yeah, yeah. Actually, that is uh, two USB uh, 3 and that is USB 2. And uh, uh, that is a PCIe slot. What can you do with PCIe? Yeah, I think uh, it can support some uh, PCIe Wi-Fi and uh, PCIe storage, big storage. And uh, with that, that means you also can turn it like, to be a, like uh, a PVR uh, devices. No need the uh, GPU. Uh, yeah, there, there's, of course, there's a, a high performance GPU. GPU it's, is in, inside, is it Yes, Mali? inside, uh, yeah. It's Mali T720. But uh, no need to have external GPU, that's not possible. Uh, I don't think so, but I think the TPU inside actually is powerful enough for, you know, such a uh, Or with case. PCIe, it's possible to use a fast e inter uh, networking? Fast uh, Wi-Fi uh, internet, yes, you can see that. Some uh, 10 gigabit, maybe? Yeah. Maybe? Yeah, maybe. Something like that. It, it depends on use case. Actually, I think a Google guys just think about that, use that to do some extension. Yeah. And um, uh, so this chipset, the High 76 90 cv CV200 uh, is mass production. Yeah, of course. It's a uh, quad core A53. Yeah. Um, so, and it's uh, target to medium to high end uh, set of box. Uh, I think it's a, it's a kind of a mainstream product. It's uh, focused on the IPTV uh, set box and also including some OTD box. Uh, also, we actually we have another part number which is designed for the uh, cast uh, set the box. So uh, here at Linaro Connect, yeah, um, and the home group, right? The yeah. Linaro home group. What is a uh, what is the support that you're getting, or what is the work towards this product being released? What is the uh, uh, the target? The home group is working a lot with Android TV and all this stuff. Yeah. So uh, I think uh, Digital Home actually there's uh, two lead lead project. One is for the uh, is we call it the Open SDK, which will combine all these uh, open source component together to be a platform for a Linux set box solution. And uh, in, uh, the another lead project actually is focused on Android TV. So actually you, you can see that we already get Android TV running on the 90s board. And uh, uh, so basically, I, we, we try to work with Google to provide uh, some kind of reference design for Android TV on 96 board. So this is the 96 board TV platform Edition, specification. Yeah. yeah, the first exactly. one. Yeah, it, it the actually it's the only one. <laughs> the only board in this specification. Yeah. So how, why you design the ports here, here, and here? Is the best way to design a, a standard? I think, uh, you know, for TV edition, actually just follow the EE spec. So for EE spec, there is, uh, you know, it's big form factor that can have more uh, port, uh, more uh, uh, device to, to connect. So there's enough USB, there's a full-size gigabit Ethernet. Yeah. There's a no standard power. 
yeah. standard system, yeah. power button, or just yeah, this and uh, audio that is out. audio, uh, and that's uh, actually that is uh, I think it's a uh, uh, five optical audio, oh, optical audio, yes, yeah. Yeah. and uh, here you can you can see that that is a, a low speed expansion, uh, that the typical Linaro uh, interface for to connect to some uh, external device. And uh, you can check that. Actually, that is very important. That is uh, the uh, the, uh, the uh, DTV interface. You can connect to the tuner board. So with tuner board, that means uh, that uh, 96 board can support some uh, traditional uh, digital TV application. So it is possible to connect to a tuner board. Yeah, of course. Digital TV, even uh, MPEG 4, 4K. Definitely. Everything. Yeah, I, I, right now uh, actually we, we already get the DVT2, DVTC2, DVS2, all these tuner boards ready. So um, for end user, they can buy the popular board with those tuner, and uh, they can just develop some uh, uh, digital TV application on there. So there's Android TV. How about uh, other Linux? Uh, so for other Linux, I think uh, we try in, in Digital Home Group, we think about maybe OpenS Seagate is uh, a good platform for those other Linux uh, set box solution. So is it RDK? Uh, it's, not, it's not RDK, actually for RDK, I think it's still uh, limited to uh, Comcast RDK, but for OpenS uh, we share uh, some components between RDK and OpenS but OpenS is more open to, uh, I think uh, it's just combine uh, all the uh, open source project like WLAN, Tishima, and uh, we just build OBS on some typical standard uh, video interface like uh, V4R2 and uh, for audio Elsa, for graphic it will be DRM KMS. So that will be, uh, it's, it's quite a typical standard uh, interface and the build on, build on that will be uh, just like uh, Gstream support video playback and uh, VLAN support the video uh, window system and the graphic and uh, with that you can build uh, some uh, wiper engine on that. Uh, so with the OpenSDK, uh, you, I think everybody can just take uh, uh, OpenSDK to develop some uh, set box solution. So there's a Kodi with the hardware acceleration V4 Linux too? Yeah, yeah. It's, everything is okay? Uh, yeah. And uh, the Linara guys are working on it? Sure. To it's a joint, joint project between Linaro, High Silicon, and uh, Hope Run. And uh, everything is stable now? Stable? Uh, ready to launch? I think for developer purposes, it's stable. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. And, uh, uh, but it, people cannot install uh, uh, Ubuntu, Fedora, some other Linux like this? It's uh, not for this? Because, no, we, we didn't do that, but I think uh, for... Uh, for the developer, they can just use uh, the open source kernel on popular to port all these, you know, Fedora, Ubuntu, they can do, do, do by themselves. So it's not only for TV? Uh, of course. It, it can be in a drone? Yeah. It can but be in a PC? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> PC, I think it's okay. Joe, maybe we have to make a small port. <laughs> and uh, uh, in a fridge or in a car or whatever, you can maybe? Or something else. Uh, this is TV. I hope so. But <laughs> I, so. I, I think for developers, they can think about that. They can just develop some new use case, and all up to them. And uh, so, how much is price? Uh, the price, the main board may be above eighty, eighty, eighty dollars. Eighty dollars. Yeah, above eighty dollars. That's okay. a good price, no? <laughs> it's pretty good price. Yeah. It I should be very so. popular. Yes, I think. Yeah. So. I, I think uh, if we just put developer in middle of popular, that will be, you know, <laughs> popular. So we popular. hope that popular will ten, turns out to be popular. That's why you name popular, right? Yeah, yes. To make it popular. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, uh, uh, and how soon? Shipping? Uh, uh, map, uh, nec maybe next month. Next month? Yeah, maybe next so month. So you will be very busy to uh, put in a factory, right? Yeah. To get them yeah. out. Yeah. 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 Cool. All right, and uh, everything is looks good now on the uh, Android TV. Uh, actually, again, just everything is smooth. Yeah, you can try. Actually, you know, uh, actually, this the uh, the orange Android TV uh, user experience. There's different channel over there, and uh, uh, you can see there is a lot of application, including YouTube, Google Movie, and. Uh, some uh, is it possible uh, to customize the UI? 
like a operator tier. Yeah, for uh, for operator, the, all the, uh, the uh, of course they can just build the operator tier with yeah. that. But for us, you know, I, we we are SOC vendor, we just provide the the platform to them. All right, and uh, are there already some customers out there with high silicon Android TV? Yeah, as exactly. many out out delivering. I, uh, we we already get, there's uh, two or three uh, project already get start and uh, there's other lots of customers just ask for Android TV solution for the you know op operate market. So so Google is a, a member in Lenaro, but do they provide support to help you to make this? They yes, they give us a lot of help. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and uh, does this work in China? Android TV? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Not yet. So, not uh, yeah. Not yet. Not yet. Because there's a lot of uh, Google services, and uh, China yeah, is a uh, you can access <laughs> in, the in only China mainland, and uh, so right and now I think that uh, for Google guys, the try to expand the uh, Android TV service to other market like Europe market, and uh, maybe North American something like that, and uh, uh, I think because of the uh, operator, so the. The operator is quite interesting on Android TV, so we expect that Android TV will be more and the more uh, operator uh, use uh, and the use a uh, customer will try to use the as a uh, you know the baseline to, to. How about Project Treble and the automatic updates? Will this be possible here? Are you going to be Android eight? What is the version of Android right Actually, now? Actually, right now we already get the Android O running. So on this board, it's already, already Android, Android O. Yeah, we, we uh, already implement the uh, treble, uh, uh, you know, get uh, the new hair layer and uh, uh, just like, uh, you know, the, the just like you, you, you heard this morning, uh, we will follow the treble rule and uh, to make sure the Android O running on, on popular. And then uh, when there's trouble, that means forever will be updated automatically. Well, I think it, maybe it's it lasts mm -hmm. that there will be, I think it's kind of a wish. I, I don't think it's reality right now. Um, but, uh, uh, you know, it's Google. So they, if they try to do it, I think uh, they may make it. Uh, they make it easy for uh, the community. Yeah. They make it maybe easy for the narrow. And uh, uh, I think the, it's for high silicon, maybe to cheap I, I to provide support updates at last uh, is make easy for google so they can upgrade the uh, android version by themselves uh, maybe so, sunday and uh, so you will have support until android 18 for 10 years <laughs> <laughs> it's up to google <laughs> we'll see. Okay. cool